Hey, this is Ron from Rip the Lip. We're here at uh, Oakland Valley Speedway with the night one of the Oktoberfest with our all-star slingshot feature winner, AJ Albreda. How are you doing, man? Oh, man, we're doing phenomenal. Uh, picking up a win here. I've ne this is my first night ever here. Ever turning a lap in a slingshot here and only my eighth time in the race car. So this is well-deserved and uh, hard work pays off tonight. Yeah, for sure. That thing was dialed in. I mean, you had that thing... I guess on rails, but I mean, it didn't look like you were really going too hard. It was nice and smooth and nice and even. Like, a, I don't know, just tell me about your preparation for this race. Honestly, we really didn't know what to expect coming into this race. Um, we were, it was really a big guessing game back home, getting the car ready on what we should do setup-wise and stuff like that. And going out for the first hot lap session, I just tried to run it nice and easy just to see what the track was like. And I mean, we were fast right out of the gate just like that. So I was like, might as well just keep doing what we're doing. Um, we had a bit of an issue after the first hot lap session with, a, with our carburetor. So we ended up switching carbs um, that, to a brand new one we just got this week. Um, so then that thing just woke the motor right up. That was absolutely the best call we made all night. And this thing is just a rocket ship, man. Yeah, man. I mean, uh, it's a weird track because you almost have, if you have a lighter foot, it seemed like you were going a lot faster because the harder you ran in there, you just wash up and you just scrub all your speed off. Um, you had something a little different. I don't know, it just seemed like you were driving a little different than everybody else. Yeah, it was, uh, a lot of it was just coming from the go-kart um, racing earlier in the year and last year. Just learned a lot of like being consistent and nice and easy to hit the same line every lap. And that's really all it came down to tonight was just letting off and roll, let, letting the car roll in nice and easy and stuff like that. I mean, hats off to my father, my brother, uh, Richie Van Orden. Those three guys, they, they worked their tails off and they were the reason why we're able to put in a victory lane tonight. Yeah, I mean, Richie's been running these things long, long time, so he's definitely got a lot of knowledge. We hooked up with that guy for sure. Yep. Um, yeah, I mean, great win. I mean, are you going to be coming back for the rest of the races? Absolutely. We'll be back here the 15th, I think it is, for that race. Um, but we're racing almost every week until the end of October, I'm pretty sure. So we'll uh, hopefully we can make another one in victory lane. Awesome. Hey, well, uh, thank you for taking the time. I appreciate it. Anybody in the car on the pitch you want to thank? Yeah, like I said, again, I got to thank my father, my brother, Richie Van Orden, the Ed Hatch and his whole family, uh, Derek Marks and their whole family. They really pitched in a bunch trying to get this car fixed tonight when we were having issues with the carburetor. Um, I got to thank DM Hawk Enterprises, uh, Velocity USA, best fire suit company you can ever imagine, Luxville Packaging Machinery Corporation, DFD Rods and Chaps, Rob Lovell, to Snap on Tools, Larkin LTD, 77 Play. Luke Pepper Creative, Scott Hamlin Racing Speed Shop, TJ Hughes Racing, Sass Motorsports, Dylan Smith Motorsports, man, the list goes on and on. Section 8 Race Camp, yep, Michael John Pierce Photos. <laughs> They're the reason why we're able to do this week in and week out, and, you know, yeah. I'm, I'm so grateful, very grateful for everything. Fantastic, man. Well, great win. Uh, appreciate you taking the time. This is AJ Abredo, uh, the driver number 22 All-Star Slingshot here, the winner at Oktoberfest night number one.